The overall goal of this assay is to quantify the locomotory component of Drosophila larval behavior. This method can help answer key questions in the behavior genetics field about genetic and environmental contributions to individual differences in larval behavior. The main advantages of this technique are that it is fast, reproducible, and allows for the collection of large sample sizes. Generally, people new to this method might struggle because the success of the assay depends on developmental timing and the consistent, careful handling of the test animals. Demonstrating the procedure will be Ina Anreider and Oscar Vasquez, graduate students in my lab. Prepare the holding bottle by cutting holes into one side of a six ounce plastic fly culture bottle. Next, use a syringe to fill petri dish lids with previously prepared grape juice medium until the surface of the grape juice medium makes a dome above the lip of the lid. Store the grape plates in a humid and airtight container at four degrees Celsius for up to two weeks. Pour 40 milliliters of previously prepared fly food into 100 by 15 millimeter petri dishes. Obtain three black plexiglass plates with 10 circular wells, 10 centimeters in diameter, and arranged in a two by five design to test the larvae. And a black plexiglass spreader used to spread the yeast paste onto the plexiglass plates. Then, separate the lids from the bottoms of the petri dishes. 